let us start designing click on solid part now let us take a look at drawing the first part we need to design is a body of a sculpture and the material used for the body is cast iron let us go to model software and click on sketch select front plane let us draw a straight line that is center axis of a height 185 mm Click on, sorry, click on smart dimension and make it 185 mm. Click on fit screen. Go back to drawing. Before that, let us draw a rough layout of a body. Uh, it's better to have the rough diagram approximately equal to the original dimension, so it will be easy while making it to a correct dimension. Okay, we are done with the rough layout. Let us mark first the horizontal values 100, 150 at the bottom and 20 mm height at the bottom. Since we are making only half of the profile, we have to give the half values. That is, for 100, we have to give only 50 mm. And for 140, we have to give 70 mm. For vertical values, the values will be same as in the drawing, that is 20 mm. Here we have to give a distance as 100 mm, so 100 by 2, 50 mm from center to that point. The, the clearance at the bottom is given as 3 mm. There is nothing to worry about if the drawing looks like this. Once we give all the dimension values, it will be correct. The vertical value here is 40 mm. And the dimensions here are 50 mm and 70 mm. So we have to give half of the values 25 and 35. Then at the center there is a value given as 66 diameter. So half the value we have to give 33. Now we have to give the total height of the profile as 185 mm. Initially what we gave was just an axis height. Give the value 185. Now click on parallel in order to make these two lines parallel to each other. 
once you make it parallel then you have to make that both the lines are equal in them use control to select okay we have already given the value in order to give the value between distance between these two lines we have to draw a straight line connecting them and then we have to make that line perpendicular to both the parallel lines and the distance given here is 10 I think we are done with the profile. Click on return. Select reward protrusion. Then select the profile. Here it should be sketch from select from sketch. Okay. I think we have some problem here. Let's get back to select tool and edit the profile. Right click, edit profile. Okay, we are missing one dimension that is, we have to give the fillet of a radius 8 mm. Select the point fillet tool and click at the center point and give a radius at 8 mm and remove the unnecessary modes. Here we can see that 10, the value 10 has an underline. This means the actual dimension here is not 10 mm, it is just showing 10 mm. So we have to correct. So again go to smart dimension and enter the value as 10 mm. Now everything is corrected. Click on return. Go to reward protrusion, select the profile, click on right mark, then select the axis, enter the value of, ang of angle as 360 degree, then go to tools, material table. From the uh, table given in the question, we, uh, we have the material for body as cast iron, enter the value. Then apply more. Go to file, file properties, enter the title as body, then go to project, document number one. And project name as again body. Click OK. File, save as. It is better to create a separate file as a screw jack where we can store all the parts. It will help us during the assembly. Enter the file name as screw jack. Save part. Once we are done open select normal dot path okay thank you